Baseball Lifestyle 101 is a community that's connecting baseball players from all over the country and world. We sell baseball apparel for kids to wear off the field. We're mainly social media based. We have a huge social media following on Instagram and now on TikTok and Facebook and all the different platforms where uh, we create a ton of content, just basically entertainment for ball players around the world as well. We've built Baseball Lifestyle into over a million followers across all platforms and a multi-million dollar company and it's crazy. My name is Josh, I'm 22 years old, founder of Baseball Lifestyle 101, and this is my hustle. What's up guys, welcome to the BL 101 HQ. I'm gonna show you guys around, let's get started. So over here, this is where we do most of our work. Uh, that's where all the meetings go down. Um, this is where myself and usually Melissa work a lot. This is Melissa. Hi. Melissa handles all of our marketing, email marketing, um, kind of everything that goes on behind the scenes as well on the website. So this is where all the orders and everything goes out um, that comes to you guys. So we've got a little bit of our jewelry set up and then this is Dennis. Dennis is our operations manager, uh, handles all the fulfillment, all the shipping. So he's got his workstation here that he's got going on. And then I'll take you guys through a little bit of the content section. This is the other Josh. Uh, he handles all of our content creation, TikTok creation, YouTube yep. creation. As you can see, he's making a TikTok, TikTok right, now. right now. This is where the magic happens, all in this area. And then I'm gonna take you guys where all the product actually lives. So this is our warehouse section, our product section. So in here is housed most of our products, including some of our best sellers. So you've got like the Buzz the Tower hat, which is our like most popular hat that sells really well. Here we've got um, some short sleeve hoodies that we got. Good for the summer, good for the for some training. One of our best selling shirts. This is a funny one. Your girlfriend likes my swing. This is one of our best sellers as well. Um, and then the windbreaker that I'm currently wearing, we've got that housed right here. So we've got sizes all listed. Uh, as well, we've got our Phantom windbreaker, which is uh, another windbreaker that we have that we came out with, which is pretty popular. But yes, yeah, so this is where we house all the product that gets shipped and all the merchandise. That's the BL101 HQ. Baseball Lifestyle 101 started when I was a sophomore in high school. Literally all for fun. Uh, I just did it because I'm obsessed with the game of baseball. I just thought I could put my two cents out there. So I just started curating content, putting different pieces that I thought was interesting, things that I would want to see. Throughout high school, um, there was really no business. It was just more for me um, kind of making enough money where I didn't have to work anywhere else. I could still make my money from social media. So at first I was just starting to get product from companies that I wanted to use because I was still playing. So it would basically be like an exchange of a post for a bat or a glove or whatever that the case was. I met Josh when he was in eighth grade and a couple of years later, he started up an Instagram account. He comes in, he's like, we just passed 5,000 followers. I want to get shirts made. And I talked to him about, you know, if 3% of your followers convert at any given time, you know, 5,000 people really isn't going to get you very many sales. Like Facebook didn't charge for anything for years. They just made a community where people could come and they could share stories and they could talk about the things that they were doing. So I was like, hey, well, let's do that. Let's build a community. And now, you know, fast forward years later, Josh is 22 and we've built Baseball Lifestyle into over a million followers across all platforms and a multi-million dollar company. And that's crazy. So over the lifetime of you know Baseball Lifestyle since 2017, we've been fortunate enough uh, this year we should pass over $5 million uh, in lifetime sales. And this year, one of our main goals is to get over uh, two to $2.5 million in total sales for the year. Um, so as long as we keep rolling, we should uh, be good on those numbers. Three, two, one. These are my ladies. This is Jill. This is my lady, Amy. Little Susie, Brianna. You know why we call it Brianna, right? <laughs> what makes Baseball Lifestyle one of the most popular brands is the type of content that we put out that our demographic wants to see. So the way we're able to connect with them and make them feel like they're a part of our community. I've personally never met somebody as obsessed with baseball as Josh is. So he's posting things that he would have wanted to see. So you have another fan who's the same age as Josh, who's following the brand because it's all the content that they're looking for in one place. And you know, you, you fast forward to now and we have guys from all over professional baseball who wear our stuff, will get on live talks with us and do things. And it's because they know that the community that they want to reach is our community. I think that's what makes us so cool is we, we kind of make them feel like they're a part of something bigger and which they are. You know, Baseball Lifestyle 101 isn't a brand, it's, it's a movement.
you know, I've been friends with Josh since we were five years old. Um, so I saw how baseball lifestyle started from the beginning and kind of how it's blossomed into what it is now. And it's just been an amazing process. And we all learn together as a group. And uh, I, I can't even imagine what the things we're going to do in the future because I know the people around us, how hard they work, how focused we are. And I just, it's going to be incredible what we can do. With my motivation, I think it's ingrained in who I am. For you, just stay self-motivated. I think, you know, some of it's just what I have and the other of it is just, you know, what I dream of. And I've always been a dreamer, whether that was on the baseball field, but in the business world, I think I have so far to go. Um, I'm just getting started. And for me, like the thought of just getting started and being where I'm at just drives me like crazy. I, I just makes me want to work so hard. Thank you guys so much for watching my episode. Make sure you guys check us out on Instagram at baseball underscore lifestyle 101 and our website, bl101.com. And make sure that you guys subscribe to The Whistle.